and we are immediately right back into uh, Resident Evil 2, and we got a boss battle coming up. Um, in the last video, uh, okay, it's Claire, dude. So, yeah, remember back in Claire's scenario, this is the moment in where they called each other? Uh, this was when Claire was at the train car itself, and we had to take on Birkin. But, um, probably thinking, like, where's X? He... I said that he was back in the last video. Where... where is he now? Oh, don't worry. You still there? Leon? Hey, Leon, you're breaking up. Yep. Forget about me. Just get out of here. Nope. I didn't hear you. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's a pain. That's a pain. Wait, what is this? Yeah, it's a knife. Oh. Oh, that was kind of open. It was like a green herb. Alright, so in this battle. Oh no wait, oh, oh no wait, it's, it's a, not a battle yet, no more. Uh, we gotta make our way through corridors, that's right. At least we got some flame fuel to all these plant guys now. Like you! Go, oh, go, oh, get away from me! part does put a number on me because time limits not really my thing. Ah oh, god Exactly Leon thanks You this the uh this music's pretty nice. And it's very uh Orchestric. Oh God. Hi. Yeah, yeah, you brought that on yourself, dude. Ow. That had to sting. Just a little bit. Oh. Okay, so we're safe for X for now, but keep going. Yep, yep. Thankfully, we didn't lose any any form of health there. That's a that's a that's a godsend right there. Uh, I think. Uh, no, I actually need uh, two slots open for this thing. Remember this from uh, Claire's scenario? Yep, yep, we're... But this time, we're taking this elevator down. And uh, there is actually uh, a trophy if you beat, uh, if you beat uh, this boss fast enough. Probably thinking, what boss? I'll give you one guess. No, 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 seriously, seriously, just, 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 just take a guess. Who it is? What? There he is. So apparently the jacket acts as an inhibitor for X, but I don't really get how that works. The weak spot is the heart. Ow! I was stuck. So if you tried to to uh, take on X uh, a prior to this point. If 
you're trying to take him on a progress point, you realize that you would know that your weapons weren't really doing anything. Christ. Okay, for some reason this gun ain't really, ain't really, uh, uh, doing as much as I remember. I don't know. Uh, I'm just gonna use that. God, I actually remembered it. Yeah, I got no idea how you, um, avoid that move. At least... That was instant kill. Okay. Okay, gang. We're here, but watch this. Okay, so everything's coming down, right? Because, uh, self destruct sequence and whatnot. And we get a rocket launcher. But we'll call it even. That was Ada. The bitch is still alive. How is that even possible? Okay, like, Ada is human. She doesn't have any superhuman feats. Suck it! Suck it, X! I gave it to you! <sighs> Anywho, sorry. So, uh, this is the rocket launcher. It's a, it's a really cool weapon. It's a pretty cool weapon. Problem is, only four shots. So, you better make them count. But... So, 
It's basically, it's like the, uh, special weapon, uh, like, uh, like Claire's chain gun in, in, uh, first scenario, but in Leon's, it's a rocket launcher, infinitely better, at least for me, because rockets do damage, but not completely done yet, not yet. We have one last thing to do. Well, after this, uh, this, uh, this, uh, uh, cutscene place, because this is Leon's perspective for while, while Claire and, uh, Sherry are doing their own thing. But, honestly, I don't get, I don't get what Leon's obsession with, with Ada is, though. I mean, the girl double-crossed him, and if this were me, okay, like, I would be, I would personally be like, well, actually, actually, like, actually, if this girl, uh, uh, backstabbed me to do whatever she wanted, I would be unknowingly nipped and never want to, uh, talk to this girl again. And this is why I wanted to do Claire A, Leon B. Uh, shit. And I don't really need a lot of this stuff because, well, <laughs> oops. Uh, shortcut to the Samurai Edge. Yeah, like, I don't really need a whole lot of this stuff. It's just... Uh... uh yeah, okay. Because... Because here's all I gotta do for this thing. Well, uh, this, uh, this, uh, scenario that is. Okay, so let me just get the rocket launcher out real quick. And it is... Good old Willy Boy! Yep. Yeah, you guys, I'm also with teeth. You got a problem with death? <laughs> I like that one. Alright. Rocket away! Come on! Want some more? Well, what the hell? Uh, I think I was supposed to wait until it showed an eye. Oh, okay. Uh, I didn't see the death screen for this, so... Awesome. <laughs> okay. Full disclosure. I've never seen anyone die from this. Okay. So that's pretty funny. That was... That was okay, okay. That made me laugh. Thank you, game. Thank you for making me laugh. Or, uh, good old, uh, Willy Boy. So, I just need to wait until, until it shows an eye. These guys are the weak thing. Yeah. Can you show me an eye already? Or this open up? I remember. There you go. Eat it. There we go. That, really, that is the funnel box. <laughs> yeah, you're just waiting for the eye to pop up. I was just, I was just a little bit too, uh, uh too, um. Trigger happy, I guess. And okay, car's going undone. Leon gets a metal rod. And I stop at me. Oh, 
Seriously? There's a land, you decided to drop an F-bomb? Like, I'm not against it being like a, like an action movie, uh, last words, but seriously, that was it. <laughs> this is kind of weak, don't you think? And that was the final encounter in Resident Evil 2 Remake. Woo! Fine. Finally got to get this game off the list. <laughs> well, okay, so I should explain the whole Claire A, Leon B thing. <laughs> sorry, sorry, uh, Jerry's thing is like, are you two dating? <laughs> I mean, I ship it. <laughs> Uh, anywho, the Claire A. Leon B. thing was actually introduced in the original version of Resident Evil 2. It was basically where, since there were two characters, each had each had their own separate way of telling. Well, well, well um, each had their own separate storylines, sort of. Uh, anywho. So, uh, Claire A. Leon B. was considered at the time to be the most canon story. If it's not, we'll stop it. But, Whatever it takes. And, and honestly, I, I still feel like that should be it, but, you know. Uh, that's like a family. You guys can adopt me! Dear God. <laughs> okay. All right. So that is the end of the Resident Evil 2 remake. If by some reason you have not played this game yet, what is wrong with you? Play this game. I mean, I mean, just, just bear in mind you won't have enough ammo for everything. It's supposed to be a survival horror game. It's not, it's not in a, an action-packed shooter like, like five and six were. Uh, okay. So, graphically speaking, the game looks phenomenal. It being the second game to use the uh, the RE engine, which was which was originally made for Resident Evil 7, which I might do later down the road. I might. No promises, I might. But, um, storyline, I thought that it was pretty good. It, it you know, like, it, it, it took the elements from um, RE2 and basically made it more grounded, realistic, and made the tone a little bit darker, which actually fits for a survival horror film. Sorry, sorry, hiccups. Claire, I really like as Claire, I really liked as. As a heroine, she was just she was just an awesome uh, uh, female badass. Not quite the same as Jill Valentine, though. But but she's a very very close second. As for Leon, he's like my he's like one of my personal favorite characters in the entire uh, Resident Evil franchise. The dude can pull off a lot of badass things, and is and is still kind of a dork at heart. I mean, I mean, you've seen, I mean, you've seen and heard his one-liners, right? <laughs> but uh, RE4 over uh, a, a, over uh, accentuates that. <laughs> Weapons are actually really nice, though I, though while ammo is limited, I. And actually, that's that's been the same complaint. <laughs> Musically, I thought that it was nice, but really, um, Resident Evil's not exactly known for its 
um, music all that well, unless unless it's like the old school uh, savory music, which you can buy as as a DLC. But I mean, eh, it's just well. But next time I head into Resident Evil. Well, I actually have you. I actually want you guys to decide for me. Should I do Resident Evil 7 Biohazard or or continue Leon's adventures through Resident Evil 4? That's what that's what I would want you you guys to decide in the comments down below. Just put hashtag Resident Evil 7 or not. Put hashtag Resident. Put put hashtag RE7 if you want me to play that game, or hashtag RE4 if you want that one. But and um, I'm just gonna skip that because basically the same thing. Four hours and I gotta be. Eh. Eh. I'm the best and actually. <laughs> Claire A, Leon B. <laughs> oh, good God, I know I'm terrible. No, oh, well, moving on. <sighs> okay. So, with Resident Evil 2 done and over with, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys in my next Let's Play. Reach for the stars.